Tonight, Hollywood is mourning the loss of two actresses who achieved fortune and fame on a pair of popular TV shows back in the 1960s and 70s. Our Phil Blower is here now with details of their deaths. And Kathleen, we're speaking about Cindy Williams and Lisa Loring. Williams played Shirley opposite Penny Marshall's Laverne on the hilarious show Laverne and Shirley. Loring was the original Wednesday Addams, the morbid daughter from the spooky sitcom The Addams Family. One, two, three, four. Cindy Williams died in Los Angeles at age 75 after a brief undisclosed illness last Wednesday, according to her children. Laverne and Shirley was a spinoff that ran on ABC from 1976 to 1983 and in its prime was among the most popular shows on TV. Williams and Penny Marshall played roommates that worked at a Milwaukee bottling factory in the 50s and 60s. She also starred in director George Lucas's 1973 film American Graffiti and director Francis Ford Coppola's The Conversation from 1974. Until last year, Williams toured around the country in her one-woman show, Me, Myself, and Shirley. It's me, Wednesday. <laughs> And sadly, we've learned about the passing of actress Lisa Loring, who was the original Wednesday Adams on the Adams Family TV show in the mid-1960s. Loring died in Los Angeles Saturday at age 64 after suffering a massive stroke brought on by smoking and high blood pressure. She took on the role of Wednesday Adams when she was just six and played the death-obsessed character until the show ended two years later. Her other acting credits also included the shows The Girl from Uncle, Fantasy Island, and Barnaby Jones. And with Lisa Loring's death, actor John Aston, who played Gomez Adams, is the last surviving member of the original cast. And by the way, Kathleen, there is no word yet on any memorial plans for either actress at this point. But